All right, that's kind of more like it. Hopefully the blown saves, is that what they're called? It's been so long, won't continue. In the meantime, here's what's new in Washington, D.C. Bryce Harper sits, but Dusty Baker says not to be alarmed. Baker made it very, very, very clear that there was nothing wrong with Bryce, that it was just a day off, stop freaking out. Okay, Sean Doolittle blows first save, Nats rally to win anyways and Doolittle is now 21 for 22 and thinks he learned a valuable lesson about not being aggressive enough coming into the first at bats. Let's talk final games of National Seasons worst probably 2008 Phillies 8, Nationals 3. Best could it really be 2016 who should start game 4 Tanner Roark looked bad, but who else could pitch game 4? Or would you throw Max Scherzer or Steven Strasburg on short rest, if you were down 21 Ryan Zimmerman embraced yoga and found his swing Ryan Zimmerman needed to make a change coming into the 2017 season, but couldn't figure out what. Last offseason, he decided to incorporate yoga, of all things. Apparently, it works really well. Swero, Johnson, Red Wind Nationals Minor League Awards winner Swero won an award. What, exactly? is the future of the bullpen bar next to Nationals Park. The bullpen may be shutting down for good, for real this time, in 2018. Or maybe it won't. Or maybe there will be a permanent bullpen. It's kinda hard to know, because, you know, real estate. After a 162-game walk in the park, the Nationals will take another trip onto the high wire. The Nationals have not had a legitimately preserved situation in months they've never once doubted how the season would end, at least the first 162 games of it. But revisiting last year's here twinching 32 series loss to Los Angeles, well, better start taking those heart medications now. Baker credits success to clubhouse leadership minor league I words the Nats have been quiet on the outside, but well on the inside frankly, the team knows what it's supposed to do. Also Wander Swera won an organizational award. Straws, Nats host meeting of former number one overall picks Jared Cole, the top selection in 2011, faces Steven Strasburg, 2009's top choice on Friday night. Worth, showing positive signs, says goodbye to Philly after his customary booing, Worth doffed his helmet to the crowd, perhaps saying goodbye one last time to the place that made him as a player, and then turned on him rapidly. Cubs beat Kyle Hendricks may be the Cubs guy to beat Scherzer, Nats Hendricks has given up all of two runs in his last three starts. In other words, if there's anyone on the Chicago side of things to beat Mad Max, it's probably this guy. Underdog Cubs relish chance to make some history against Nationals Chicago, is looking at the playoffs yet again, but this year as an underdog, if not to the Nationals, then to the Dodgers, or Indians. However, the Nats apparently strike some fear in the Cubbies' hearts. What time will the Cubs Nats and LDS start? It's complicated. It's hard to know which series is the A series and which is the B, which gets the day and which gets the night, especially with every time zone in the United States being represented. What if both teams got night games? Though what following the Cubs to DC? Here's what you got to know. Tickets there few and far between and expensive. Travel Spirit Airlines or Amtrak, and you may only pay somewhere around $800 to see the NLDS. Seriously, wait to spend your money, Cubs fans. You just did this last year. Chill out. Today's game Pirates vs. Nationals, 705 probable pitchers Jared Cole vs. Steven Strasburg, 